Do you want to install Google Pixel 3 camera APK on your Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro without having to root your phone? That's what we're going to do in this video. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure you subscribe to the channel and click on the bell icon to get notified of new videos. Hey YouTube, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install the Google Pixel 3 camera APK or Google Camera 6.1 APK on your Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro. Do note, I'm running stock MIUI 10 with an unlocked bootloader and I do not have Twerp Recovery installed nor am I rooted. So what are the things which you need to install Google Pixel 3 camera APK on your Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro? You need an unlocked bootloader, you need ATB and fastboot setup, you need the twerp recovery image file for the Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro, you need the manual camera compatibility test app, and you need the Google Pixel 3 camera APK. All of these are linked in the description of the video. Once you've downloaded the Google Pixel 3 camera APK, ADB and fastboot zip file, and the twerp recovery for the Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro, go ahead and place them inside one folder. Next thing which we need to do is we'll go ahead and extract the ADB and fastboot. Once you have extracted ADB and fastboot, you will have another folder. Go ahead and rename this guy to platform hyphen tools. The next thing which we need to do is we'll go ahead and rename the twerp recovery zip file as well. Just makes it easier for me to type. We'll go ahead and rename it to twerp hyphen virate.img. Once that is done, we'll go ahead and move this image file to the platform tools folder. The thing which you need to ensure over here is that you have the twerp recovery image file in the same folder as you have fastboot and ADB. As for the Google Pixel 3 camera APK, go ahead and transfer it to the Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro. All right, YouTube, first thing which we need to do is we need to go ahead and enable camera to API. So before I do that, let's go ahead and open the manual camera compatibility tool test and then we'll go ahead and click on start over here and as you can see camera to api is not enabled on my xiaomi redmi note 5 pro so to do that we need to first boot the device into fast boot mode go ahead and power off your device once your device is powered off go ahead and press and hold the volume down button and at the same time press and hold the power button till you see the fast boot logo this is how fast boot mode looks like at this point we'll go ahead and connect a phone to the computer once you're on the computer mac and linux users need to open terminal windows users can open command prompt or powershell then you need to navigate to the folder where you have extracted adb and fast boot and in the same folder we had placed the twerp recovery for the xiaomi redmi note 5 pro the first thing which we're going to do is we'll go ahead and check whether our device is being detected in fast boot mode or not the command for that is fast boot space devices mac and linux users and windows users on powershell need to enter dot slash before the commands command prompt users can ignore the dot slash once you've entered the command go ahead and press enter and there as you can see my device is being detected in fast boot mode the next thing which we need to do is we'll go ahead and boot into twerp recovery so the command for that is fast boot boot twerp hyphen wired dot img go ahead and press enter and at this point a device will boot into twerp recovery once a device has booted into twerp recovery if you get a notification about allowing system modifications go ahead and ignore that and now we'll go ahead and check whether our device is being detected in adb mode or not the command for that is adb devices go ahead and press enter and there as you can see a device is being detected in adb mode the next two commands are used to enable camera to api on the xiaomi redmi note 5 pro i have the commands listed in the description of the video just go ahead and copy paste them once you've pasted the first command go ahead and press enter we did not get an error message which means the first command was executed successfully next thing we'll go ahead and execute the second command once you have copy pasted it go ahead and press enter and there we did not get any error message which means the second command was also executed successfully now we'll go ahead and just issue the command to reboot the device so the command for that is adb reboot go ahead and press enter and at this point your xiaomi redmi note 5 pro 
will reboot all right youtube once we've put it back into miui 10 we'll go ahead and open the manual camera compatibility app go ahead and click on start over here and bam there as you can see we have successfully enabled camera to api on the xiaomi redmi note 5 pro the next thing which we need to do is we'll go ahead and open file manager over here once we are in file manager we'll go ahead and click on apks over here and now we need to go ahead and select the google pixel 3 camera apk go ahead and click on install over here once the app is done installing go ahead and click on done over here go ahead and click on the home button over here back on the home screen we have a new camera icon this is the google pixel 3 camera apk or google camera version 6.1 go ahead and open this guy over here it will ask us for some permissions go ahead and click on allow 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 and allow for one last time and there we have successfully installed google pixel 3 camera apk on the xiaomi redmi note 5 pro let me take a picture of my friend over here bam this is it we just took a picture of my friend mr walter white from breaking bad that's it for this video youtube i hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you